Huh? You're dead. Get him! Get him! Oh, I got it. <laughs> oh boy, there we go. Teamwork! Teamwork! <laughs> it's such a gorgeous day out. I had to go blooming to four. But it's just taking the direct route home. I decided to take the scenic route. Probably fresh air, get some sun. On the way home, I'm like, oh, it's ice cream. Oh. I should go to like Dairy Queen. Shop local. So I'm at the Hoosier Cupboard. It's an old, I don't know if actually, you hey, it used to be an old train depot. Tracks right there. Tracks are still used. Well, there's no longer stuff. But they make their own ice cream. I think they make their own waffle cone. I'm not sure. And they also sell candy. Like chocolates and stuff. And then that big one. Stuff you buy like by the pound. You know, like gummy worms and stuff like that. So, this is their chocolate chip cookie dog stream ice cream. Because it's got chocolate chips. If it's cookie dough, like what you expect, but also has its natural cookie. So it's got baked and unbaked chocolate chip cookie dough. I'm gonna finish eating this before it melts. Head on home. So. As gorgeous as it is out. It's also very, very windy. And not much fun to drive. Although, in my car, the amp is better than the wind. I love ice cream once it gets warm. It's like the only thing I'm gonna eat. Some crazy people that I know will eat ice cream while you're around. Even when it's below zero, which I think is bonkers, but. Our Dallas today? Perfect. Happy Saturday, everybody. It is another lovely day. It's not nearly as warm as it was a couple days ago. It's like, did my car say 65? It was like 85 the other day when I stopped to get that ice cream. Uh, so, <laughs> significantly cooler, but the sun's out, so it's um, tolerable. It's not nearly as windy. It was so, so windy yesterday. I kid you not. I had trouble uh, keeping our, opening our, apartment door because I had the porch door open 
to get some fresh air and most of the time it's not a problem um, occasionally it will gut you know get strong enough that like it'll you know if we're having to go exit the apartment to take out the trash or something like it'll blow the door closed behind you kind of roughly but it's not too bad yesterday it was blowing so hard that I was struggling to get the apartment door <laughs> like to stay open for me to get through it it was kind of nuts I had to bring the tree in because it was just like blowing it over and like down the hallway um, so I ended up having to bring the tree in <laughs> that fake tree that we have outside our door um, so I ended up bringing it in until I closed the porch door later in the day <laughs> <laughs> it's like alrighty then it was so windy um but it's not it's breezy today but not nearly as bad so that's good um but um since it's not raining excuse me like it's supposed to tomorrow ooh, pardon me um I thought I would take advantage and get out of the house for a little bit so I am at the outlet mall and I need to look for a few things. I don't necessarily need to be, um, you know, doing an exorbitant amount of shopping. Um, I don't normally, anyway, clothing-wise, most of my wardrobe is actually from the thrift store, which I love. Um, but uh, for, you know, those those wardrobe items that you don't necessarily want to buy secondhand, um, I like getting at the outlet, so... Um, it's kind of busy here, but it doesn't seem to be too bad. Um, so we will see what kind of bargains I can find, I guess. So. <laughs> on the rain <laughs> not in between the raindrops but it's probably be the last time I ever see Oscar at least in person Chauncey's getting the license plate off of him that's the last thing to retrieve from him and then the car insurance company's coming to get him on Monday and they'll go through and figure out how much money I'm gonna get for him I guess he looks even more sad now that it's cold and rainy and muddy and bleh. We had to disconnect the battery last time we were here because it opened the, uh, I don't know if you can get in. Because <laughs> of the battery and the power. I got into it and shut the door and it caused the horn. Oh, so he had to disconnect the battery. Oh, bye. Cars and electronics. It's fun. It's such a good car. That is 
Then do you want me to get you that some clothes so or grass. something? No, I think I'm good because I wore my raincoat. I don't care if these are wet. So once I take these off. Well, I, we can get you some shorts and I can yeah, like, we can rinse them All off right, and dry them. I'll see if they'll fit me or whatever. But yeah. yeah. Here, okay, just take this we'll and I'm actually going to hose the pants off. Fine. So. Yeah. So you can hose them down before you throw them in there. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I'll get it. Something with a stretchy, uh, I don't even want to touch it. That's gross. It's there. Give him a rope. <laughs> See you guys so gross. Gross. Really okay. robe, you know? Boys in mud. <laughs> the thing is, Chauncey hasn't been drinking yet. <laughs> oh my you have your video? This is Stone Cold Sober. Yeah, come, come out here. I'm going to hose them down. He's going to video of me hosing them down. <laughs> It's like being back in Boy Scouts again, I'm sure. I don't like mine that done. Yeah, you're doing too much there. <laughs> what are you doing? He likes them. Keep the liquor away from them. <laughs> That's gonna explode. <laughs> All right, I gotta, I gotta film it too. Ah! They paid me to come roast their marshmallows. Dial 555. We'll go on Facebook. Look for Chauncey the Marshmallow Man. There you go. I'm an elevator. This is not what Earl Smith meant. Not real, the it was not perfectly balanced. Gaff! Gaff! got a hand cramp. It's like the crucible.